take for this heavyweight championship fight. Verdum is six years his senior. Dos Santos weighed in at 238 pounds. The you ready? You ready? All right, here we go, up for grabs tonight, the title of baddest man on the planet as we get set to crown a UFC heavyweight champion. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Verdun. Dos Santos' kick is blocked. Right on the button. Oh, he lands he rocked him with that right, right hand. hand. These guys are going at it here right away. Trading oh, blows. Oh, he's got him right here. The champ is rocked. He's in deep trouble. He's trying to hang on to keep his title. Well, goes in and secures the takedown. Out of nowhere, this choke. He's looking for the arm triangle here. What he wants to do is secure the arm, then move into side control and rotate his body towards his opponent's head to apply pressure to get the tap. Wow. Now he's inside control. Verdun gets up cool. He wanted this fight back to its feet despite having a dominant position on the ground. Oh, he connects there. Yep, not a ton behind it, but it landed. Leg kick checked by JDS. That one hurt. Good combination so far from both men. Overhand block there by Verdun. Well, he got cracked to the head there. Just oh! Huge right hand! He's in big, big trouble here. Throw that leg over. He's got that. He's got the knee over the ankle. Pins down. It's getting tighter. This could be it. He could tap. Stunning. And, that was Stunning. Do it. and he really made it look easy. He got choked, didn't tap in time, and went out. Yeah, that's about as good as it gets with that choke. And if you're not willing to tap out as he was not, then you're going to go to sleep. And that's exactly what happened. A beautiful setup and even better technique to get the finish to put him out cold. And here's the end. Let's see it one more time. Got the arm in deep under the neck, locked in tight. And it's over before they even get a chance to tap. And here we see it again. Beautiful submission victory. All right, so there is the consensus baddest man on the planet, the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion, your winner tonight by way of submission. He leaned on the grappling. That was the path of least resistance. And that is the man they are all chasing for UFC heavyweight gold. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 25 seconds of the very first round. For the winner by submission, and still, the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Fabrizio Bacabana And still the baddest man on the planet, and now with another highlight for the real, the heavyweight champion submits the number one contender here tonight and now celebrates with his corner after just a monumental performance here tonight. I'm not sure we've ever seen our tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. Verdun is six years his senior. Dos Santos weighed in at 238 pounds. The reach is the same. Now for the... Here you go, first round, you ready? You ready? Let's All right, go. here we go. UFC heavyweight title is on the line. Let's see which man exits as the consensus baddest man on the planet. Nice one-two there. Vai Cavallo gets caught by that straight punch. His defense has abandoned him tonight. Whoa! The champ is rocked. He's in big trouble here. We could be seeing a new champion right now. Immediately shoots for the leg. 
Well, he's playing with fire here, Joe. He continues to be vulnerable to that jab by almost leaning into it right into his opponent's range. Got to find a way to move those feet and ultimately get that head off of the center line. Straight right, he misses. That strike will count. How about that shin? That's some good takedown defense right there. Single leg attempt, no good. Oh. Gets in the clinch yet again. Oh, head kick blocked though by Dos Santos. Oh, that was a big left hand he connected with. for the victory. Well, Joe, you knew if he landed that weapon repeatedly, it could be a short night for his opponent, but that was just one perfectly placed strike that his opponent candidly didn't even see coming. It landed flush, and the rest, as they say, is history. Big knockout win for him here tonight. And here's the end of the fight. Let's take a look at it one more time. Here's the knockdown, vicious strike. Look at this. Ba boom! So the celebration is on for the UFC heavyweight champion of the world, the baddest man on the planet, and your winner, yes, by knockout here tonight. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is called to stop in this contest at 2 minutes, 28 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and new undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Junior. So some UFC history tonight as we crown a new UFC champion. Congratulations to fighter and team. And man, are they going to enjoy this one. A lot of people not giving them a chance coming in here tonight. And this is a moment that at times people just thought we wouldn't see. New champion here tonight. The longtime incumbent is out. There is a new or tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. The Brazilian is 34. The Russian is 41. Dos Santos is five inches taller. He will have a four-inch reach advantage. You ready? You ready? Let's All right, go. here we go. UFC heavyweight title on the line. This should be good. Went for the inside leg kick. Opens with the left hand and lands flush. Timing his shots nicely now. Good combination. Beautiful right hand. He's fainting with the punch. Effective jab there by Dos Santos. So both guys landing at will here. Good action early. Oh, he left his head wide open to absorb that straight hand. He has shown a vulnerability here by leaning in right into his opponent's range. Oh, nice. Just out of range, though, with it. Oh! He's got him He's got him here. The champ is in deep danger right now. He is desperately oh. trying to hang on. Oh! Oh! He's, he's hurt. Really threw everything into that uppercut, but 
fell short. Connects now with the one-two. He's got a clinch. That one hurt. Strong defense there to block the shot. Nice instincts. Beautiful. Oh, oh big oh, up. He's got oh, a Finish the fight here. Yeah, Joe, a pinpoint strike to end this fight. It landed flush. I'm not even sure the opponent wholly saw it coming. And before he could recover, the referee was in to stop the fight. So a huge knockout victory for that fighter here tonight. And here's the end. Let's take a look at it again from a different angle. Look at the power in this right hand as it lands. Picture perfect for the knockout. And here we see it one more time. Look at the timing in this shot. Bang! So on the sport's biggest stage, he comes up large. The baddest man on the planet, the UFC heavyweight champion of the world, your winner and by knockout here tonight. All right, we now go inside the octagon where Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 18 seconds of the very first round. You're playing the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Chicago the Well, he came in with the moniker of baddest man on the planet, and that is exactly the way he goes out. Congratulations to the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, your winner tonight by way of the KO. And that's a big man celebrating with his team right now. Enjoy it, boys. You maximize the moment tonight. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. Two years apart, these two fighters with similar height and reach. You ready? You ready? Let's All right, here we go. UFC heavyweight title is on the line. Finds a home for that left hook. Oh! That one hurt. Big elbow there, Lance. The left hook hits home. They're trading blows here. What an exchange. Oh, very nice. Oh, straight right. Vicious combinations. Oh, strong punch there by Dos Santos. Well, he leaned right into that hook shot, Joe, and that is certainly something that bears watching here moving forward. I know he's confident in his chin, but he's a sitting duck there walking right into the pocket to absorb that hook. Dos Santos gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. I mean, the hand speed, just absurd. Timely defense there. Huge block for him. There's the kick. He landed a left hand there. Straight right hand now, just misses. Hard one to the body. Oh, head kick. Staying busy here, connecting with a barrage of punches. Nice body kick. Ooh, straight punch. That'll work, Joe. Ooh. He lands a huge elbow to the head. Huge elbow there, Joe. Oh, a nice inside leg kick landed there by Dos Santos. Hard hook. Oh. the shot here, Joe. Big straight punch. Try to establish that jab. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Couldn't agree with you more. Oh, oh wow. The champ is in big trouble. 
trouble. He's in deep danger right now. Who saw this coming? He's got him hurt here. Wow! Whoa! Coming, it's blocked. Dos Santos gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up, Joe. Oh, Round two straight ahead. And here's a nice shot, lands perfectly. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. Some real clean striking on display in that round. Brittany Palmer with us. Okay, you ready? Round two. Ready? Let's All right, let's get to round two. That last round was an all-out roll. They can go. He blocks the punch. Some nice back and forth action here. Man, Joe, he continues to leave that head open. His opponent. He tagged him again. He's hurt. This could be it right here. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. There's a nice inside leg kick. Yeah, oh. looks a little wobbly on his feet. Gigantic kick for the knockout. I should say so. A tremendous kick to end that fight tonight. Caught his opponent flush, full force, full extension, and he had no chance to stay in this fight. Fight was over as soon as that kick made flush contact. And here's the end of the fight. And here we see it from a different angle. Look at the power in that kick. And as soon as it lands, that is the end. Look at this. Boom. So the celebration is on for the UFC heavyweight champion of the world, the baddest man on the planet, and your winner, yes, by knockout here tonight. The official decision is in. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mugliano has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 37 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Junior Chicago. So the celebration is on, and it figures to continue deep into the night for the UFC heavyweight champion, and still after the knockout victory here tonight. And given all this man has accomplished, I think you can still argue that tonight is the crown.